Hey, James back from Barber Creek Long Range Hunting School. We're going to talk a little bit about viewing trace or bullet trace. As the bullet travels through the air, the sunlight shines through the heat waves coming off the ground, hence that's called mirage. You see it when you drive. And a bullet has a pressure cell that comes off the tip and it will actually move the mirage out of the way. So it looks like a little boat going through water. The reason we use that is if we make a bad shot, we can see if we missed or if we made a good shot, we can actually see the trace disappear inside of the animal. So Alan and I are going to go ahead and engage this ram. It's at 728 yards. We've got a left to right wind looking at the mirage running about 2 mile an hour, maybe 2.3 mile an hour uh, from left to right. So I'm going to set up for trace. And when you set up for trace, don't get directly behind the shooter. Move about one, maybe two feet left or right. The reason is, is because you want to be able to see that parabolic curve. This is a Creedmoor or a, in this case, a 6x47 Lapua, one of those cartridges. It's going to have about an eight foot above the ground parabolic curve at a thousand. We're at 728, so we're probably somewhere around seven feet above the ground. So that parabolic curve, we want to see it, and that's that trace line. And if you're directly behind a shooter, you're only going to catch the back end of the trace. So always move left or right. Another thing, if you got a 20 by 60 uh, spotting scope like the Swirl right here, don't set it on 60 magnification. It slims your field of view. You want a nice wide field of view. So put it at about 40. You don't need to see the bullet holes. You're going to see it hit the animal anyway, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and stop talking, and we're going to put a bullet down range. So stand by. Here we go. All right, Alan, I got left to right at about 2.3. So I think we're going to be somewhere around, I'd say, three-quarter minute left wind. Ready. Send it. Shot. Hey, that was a great shot with that burger bullet. That ram would have dropped right in its tracks. It was straight up the leg, center in the body like it's supposed to. And now it made a good shot. Hey, another uh, downrange shooting tip from Barber Creek Long Range Shooting School. Thanks for joining us.